Hey guys, Merry Christmas Eve. It's your girl Raquel, AKA the Mace Medium, coming to you this beautiful Arizona afternoon. Um, I promised you guys I would give you guys um, my Christmas inspiration makeup look and I'm in one of my favorite onesies to do this look for you guys. So let's see if you guys can tell me if you guys know this, that'd be awesome. All right guys, so I got my rings on today, sorry, I'm a jewelry. My pumpkin jack. It's my favorite. My bestie got it for me for my wedding. And then, of course, my wedding ring. All right, guys. So, what I'm going to start off with. Let me just take this ring off. That one is going to. That one's, like, full of diamonds everywhere. I don't own any of the rights to the sounds in the background. I'm sorry. So, we'll see. First, I'm just going to put a little bit of moisturizer on my face. I don't want my face to be too broken or out. I don't want to put too much makeup on. You gotta take care of your face. I'm using this, um, it's a water gel moisturizer. It's by H2O Plus Beauty. Um, this is actually my second time trying it. I tried it because I got it in my Ipsy bag, but it's a pretty nice one. It's pretty decent. So far, so good. Um, I like that Ipsy sends me little things so I could try it before I buy it. That's how I try and I get all the products that I like. Now, let's start with uh, the Tor the what is this? The Benefit Pore Professional Primer. I have two primers, so we'll try this one because I got it from my Ipsy bag, so of course we're gonna give this a go. with my hands um i grew up in the 90s so that's how we learned how to do our makeup so sorry new millennial girls i'm trying to catch up to you guys i promise <laughs> all right guys this is another one that i actually liked um it was from my itsy bag it's the lock color locket the good foundation it's the bb plus the foundation this is actually a really good brand um i ordered this i'm waiting it for it to come because it was that, I liked it that much. I liked it, the coverage that it provided. Sorry, I had to let my ears go. Because I got to make sure that I get this equally all good in it. Like, blended. Like, blending is life, guys. Blending is life. So, it's my Christmas Eve. He, well, it's everyone's Christmas Eve. Hello. But it's Christmas Eve, so I figured we would do a little bit of a green and red look. But I'm not like any traditional type of person. I want to do something cute and fun. But everyone's jumping on like, oh, let me put a Santa hat or the Grinch or something. And I'm just like, I'm not that artistic, guys. I don't have that much patience. I thought about doing the lights. I tried it out and I was like, mm, this ain't for me. I'm not really digging it. So 
last one. No, let me stick to what I'm good at. So let me stick to that. I'm like, let me stick to that, guys. And I'm just going to go over just a little bit just to make sure that it's all good in the hood. Because I still have to do my contouring, guys. I've been practicing. I tell you guys all the time, like, I'm not, I haven't been doing contouring a lot but I've been practicing I think I'm getting a little bit better at it I've been using my wet and wild blending contour stick but for little blemishes like this I like to add a little bit of this is my NYX this is my you know helps cover up little blemishes that I'm not really feeling One of the perks of having polycystic ovarian syndrome, I guess, is uh, the irritating outbreaks on your face. That's not too bad, I guess. I don't have a lot of hair on my face. That's good. So, anyways, I started with that. Now, let's get into our contouring. I like to start with my dark and then move into my lights. So, let's get this warrior paint going. Um, Me, just because... I lost a little bit of hair when I was pregnant with my last daughter. It's still growing in, so I just like to contour it a little bit just so that my forehead isn't so, so prominent. And then I, of course, come down. I have this really beautiful mixed nose. I like my mixed nose. Yes, I do it. Kind of looks like the tip of um, a baseball bat. You know what I mean? When you're going down, but it's okay because it gets blended in. Sorry, guys. I usually wear my glasses. I can't wear contacts because I have really dry eyes. So, I don't really want to do too much today. We'll just do a little bit. Just a little bit. I hope you guys are having a beautiful Christmas Eve. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you want, please like and subscribe. Push the like and subscribe button. You guys can follow me on Instagram at mzcanyas09. That is M-Z-C-A-N-E-Z-09. -E and you guys will see my beautiful picture up there of my before and after my weight loss transformation. You guys can follow any progress updates that I post on there. You guys can just follow in general. I'm always posting on there about my personal life and just the things I like to do. Blending is my bestie. Sorry, guys. You got to make sure you blend. I'm like, blend, blend, blend. So you guys can always check me out there. You guys can check me out on Facebook at Raquel Kanyas. Um, I prefer you guys check me out on the Mason Medium page instead. You heard that right. It's M-E-S-A Medium. Mesa Medium. I actually do free live readings on my Mesa Medium page um, at least once a week. So if you guys want to see how I work and all of the stuff, how I work and the stuff that comes through, please feel free to join in on one of those lives. You guys can ask one question and I will try my best to answer it and help you guys the best of to my abilities. I'm all like blending to the music and talking at the same time so you guys can't really hear the music because I don't want to get in trouble. My family's enjoying some quality time playing. I'm actually going to take my little contouring brush. I like this little contouring brush. It helps me out. Just helps smooth everything out. And then I'll go and blend it with my beauty blender.
Trying to make sure everything is blended. Blend, 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 blend. The blend goblin. They say beat your face. They really mean beat your face. Like, geez. I have I give it up to a lot of the YouTube girls that can do this on the regular and not get tired because my arm is a little tired just from doing <laughs> Just the little makeup that I've already done. My arm is like, dang. Feeling like I've done a bunch of bicep curls. There we go. Pretty blended. Now let's do our lighter shade of blend. All right. Yes, I do all of my face before I do everything else. And don't worry. You guys will see how I'm able to do everything. Only girls will understand the faces we make while doing makeup. Hello guys. Hello guys. I know there are some of you guys on here. I'll see some of you guys. This is why I'm not live today. I couldn't go live today. But I made sure to do a video for you guys because... I wanted you guys to feel the love for Christmas Eve. For Christmas, I'll probably be busy. I'm a mom. It's the best gift I've ever been given. Like, best gift. I think a lot of moms take that for granted sometimes. Because they're so tired and overwhelmed, but... When I get tired and overwhelmed, I think of the process that I had to go through to get my kids struggling with infertility. And around this time of year, it's always the hardest because me and when we were, we just had our son and we were trying to have another baby and I miscarried. And it just makes me a little sad, but now I have three beautiful kids, so I always try to like be thankful and appreciative even on the hardest moments because I'm a mom there are times like I just want to give up because I feel like I'm failing but I think that's normal and I think that's natural for every mom to feel that way as long as you're doing the best that you can to provide and be the best healthy you for your kids I think that's what's most important but I feel like sometimes I want to go crazy but it's a blessing because I just think, oh, I know there's a lot of girls out here that were struggling just like me to have children. So I'm so thankful and appreciative. Blend, guys. Blending is your friend. My husband turned the music off, so I'm just like kind of bored now. I usually blend on the beat. There's no beat, so I'm just going to beat it. I need our setting powder. I'm going to use my Physician's Formula. This is like one of my favorite powders. The Physician Formula, it's the Mineral Wear and it's the Natural Beige. So that's what I'm going to be using today. Natural Beige and the Physician's Formula.
I wanted to try a new blush color, but I'm going to stick with using the Gigi Gorgeous. Just putting this on the base of my cheekbones, the apple part. Alright, with my eye primer, I used the Wet n Wild eyeshadow primer. I think it was like maybe three, four dollars at Walmart. I usually use the Urban Decay primer, but I was in a bind and I needed this. And this has been just as good as my Urban Decay. So, don't knock it till you guys try it. I told Santa I wanted the brand new Morphe Jeffree Star palette. I wanted one of his palettes. I haven't gotten one yet, and I really wanted one. So I was like, please, Santa, let me have one. So hopefully I've been a good girl, and I've been on the naughty list for all the right reasons so that I can get one. Because that's all I want for Christmas. It's the Jeffree Star Morphe palette. His cut, the colors on... That bitch's palette is phenomenal. And I have been one of the last bitches to fucking... Sorry. Beep, beep. Sorry. Boop that. I've been the last person to try it. So I want to try it. All right. All I'm going to do is use this pretty little setting color right here. I'm just going to put this on. It's just a base. Blend, blend, blend. I always want to blend. Alright, so we're going to do um, a green and red look. So I'm going to use my Revolution palette. Um, if you guys can see, it's the Revolution Reloaded. This is probably one of my favorite, favorite palettes that I have right now. Um, besides my Revolution uh, Cannabis Chilled palette. It's one of my second favorites. My kids are having a fabulous time. They're really filled with the Christmas spirit today, guys. They're living their best life. They don't got to care about nobody. They're living their best life. I want to be my kids, dude. All right. So we're going to do a, a red and green look. So let's see. Let's start with a little bit of yellow. Yes, I'm using Kleenex because it helps. Just want to add some color. Okay. All right, now I'm going to actually start because I want to do the red and green. So I'm going to start and I'm going to take the green this green right here and I'm gonna start doing this again I'm just gonna put my little piece of tissue right here because it helps line it up when you're in a bind and you don't have what you need
Blending is super important, guys. Blending is your friend. You always got to make sure to blend. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to blend perfectly. Perfect. Looks a little funny now. But I gotta make it go on the other side. Alright, guys. Let's see. Now, what I did is added a little bit of yellow just at the tip, just to start my base. Because I want it to kind of look like a Christmas tree in that sense. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to lay the yellow down and have that be my base. Okay. Now we're going to take the same green that we took the first time to use it again and we're going to do the same thing got to make sure to really blend too Not so bad, right? I actually like it. Looks rather cute. Digging it. Now let's get to the red. I'm going to do some red and I, I actually want to try to do some white on the bottom. We'll see how this works out though. I'm sorry you guys keep hearing my kids in the background. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I'm trying to decide what, how I want to put the red on. But I think we'll go full red and then start with some white. We'll try to do some white eyeliner or something. We'll see. I'm going to take this red right here. And I'm going to take this brush right here. I use it so much I can't even read the what it is anymore. So... We'll see. All right, let's take this red. We're going to line this back up. Because a little bit of this red got into my green. It's going to irritate me. There we go. That's a lot better. <laughs> it's not like it was bugging me. There's my red because we're going to still do more. I didn't want to go all the way completely to the edge to where the other ones are. I got to make sure that I keep it clean. So now let's go back to the red. Again, we're going to put this on.
I think there's some more red on this side. Right now, it looks pretty basic and normal, but I promise it's going to look pretty good. I have a little bit of this because I want some white in this under. Brush clean because I don't want to get pink on there. I want white. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use this brush instead. The smudge brush. We're just gonna use this. What I'm just going to do is just add a little white on the inside. Just a little bit. You guys will see in a minute when we do all our finish look. I'm going to add some gold. I'm starting to look pretty decent. I am mad at it. Just adding a little red and green to the bottom too. Not fully, just to the edges.
So before I upload this video, are you going to mute it or what are you going to do? Do it after you go. Turn on the monetization so if it gets hit, if it doesn't get hit, I'll edit it. Okay, we're just muting it. I'm gonna need you to mute the whole thing because you guys are talking and everything the whole freaking time. I'm trying to get my wing just perfect, guys. Sorry. You guys are like sat right in front of my. And I'm like, hold on, I gotta make sure it's perfect. Perfect. And I'm like, yes, that's what I was looking for. Mm, I like the way she work. Okay. She always puts me first. Okay. I was gonna add a star to make it pretty and Christmassy, but you guys can see what the colors. This is my Christmas Eve look. This is my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. I really don't like putting on lipstick that often. Honestly, I don't. So we'll just keep it a neutral color. Alright guys. This is my look. Merry Christmas Eve. I hope you guys have a beautiful holiday and whatever you guys celebrate. Happy holidays.